चैप्टर थर्टीन क्लोथिंग नोटबुक वर्क पार्ट वन हेलो किड्स वेलकम टू योर साइंस क्लास स्टूडेंट्स एज यू नो दैट इन द लास्ट साइंस क्लास वी हैव कंप्लीटेड द बुक वर्क एंड रीडिंग ऑफ द चैप्टर थर्टीन नाउ टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट नोटबुक वर्क ऑफ चैप्टर थर्टीन ओके सो टेक आउट योर साइंस नोटबुक्स ओपन अ न्यूली फ्रेश पेज राइट टूडेज डेट ऑन द टॉप आफ्टर देन राइट चैप्टर थर्टीन The name of the chapter is clothing. Okay, so students, first of all, write this heading. Write this heading flow chart. Underline it, and after then draw this flow chart. This flow chart is about clothing. There are two types of clothing: traditional clothing and unstitched clothing. Traditional clothing: sherwani, kurta, and pyjama, salwar kameez, and sari. on the other hand in unstitched clothing the clothes will be turbans shawl dhoti okay so students first of all so students draw this flow chart in your notebook in a very neat and clean handwriting use use your scale to draw these lines okay now take a new page we will paste the picture of these fabric in the diagram part okay now write the heading diagram and write this question paid paste different types of pieces of fabric like jute cotton woolen nylon etc students yahan par aapko kuch bhi draw nahi karna hai in this diagram part you have to paste the pictures aapko pictures paste karne hai of different types of pieces of fabric yani alag alag type ke fabric ke pieces ke like maine aapko picture yahan par isliye uh, पेस्ट करके शो किए हैं ताकि आपको इजीली अंडरस्टैंड हो जाए कि आपको किस टाइप से यहाँ पर पिक्चर पेस्ट करने हैं हियर यू कैन सी देर आर फोर टाइप्स ऑफ फैब्रिक जूट कॉटन वुलन एंड नायलॉन एंड यू हैव टू पेस्ट द पीस ऑफ फैब्रिक नॉट टू ड्रॉ दी पिक्चर्स पिक्चर्स ड्रॉ नहीं करने हैं आपको जस्ट फैब्रिक के पीसेस पेस्ट करने हैं एंड राइट द नेम अंडर दैम Now after the diagram you will write this new word okay there is only one new word in this chapter that is traditional now what is the meaning of traditional relating to tradition or culture yani that thing which are relating relating to our tradition jo hamare tradition se jo hamari sanskriti se belong karti hain cheeze that are called traditional things you will write this heading new words then underline it then write this word under this heading new words Okay students after after this draw a line with the help of your scale and start question answers now under the new words we will start this question answer you have to write this heading answer the following questions and underline it after then you will write question number 1 why do we put on clothes yes students why do we put on clothes hum clothes kyu wear karte hain Answer is we put on clothes to cover our body and protect from the heat, cold, rain and insects. So students, we put on clothes. हम कपड़े इसीलिए पहनते हैं to cover our body, अपनी body को cover up करने के लिए and to protect ourselves. और अपने आप को किस किस चीज़ से protect करने के लिए Yes, heat, cold, rain and insects. Now after the answer one, draw a line with the help of your scale and write question number two. List four traditional clothes worn by people in our country. Yes, the answer is some of the traditional clothes are sherwani, lungi, kurta, dhoti, and pyjama, sari, and salwar kameez. Okay, there are some traditional clothes. Okay, after then draw a line with the help of your scale. Right, question number three. list the clothes you like to put on so students you have to give the answer of this question yourself because only you know which clothes you like to put on aapko kaun se kapde pehanna acha lagta hai so you will write the answer yourself and after then you will draw a line with the help of your scale and write question number 4 what are some of the unstitched clothes used in our country yes in our country which unstitched clothes used Which unstitched clothes used? Yes, the answer is some of unstitched clothes are turban, 
dhoti and shawl okay once again some of unstitched clothes are turban dhoti and shawl okay so after the answer 4 you will draw a line with the help of your scale so that's all for today complete this work in your notebook thank you and have a nice day